Hi everyone, Fatma here from Addictive Tips and I'm going to show you how you can give files inside a folder the same name as the folder itself on Windows 10. There's two ways to do this. The first is with this Windows Rename feature. Open up a folder and copy the folder's name to your clipboard. Inside you want to select all the files in the folder and then on the ribbon select Rename. You can also right click the files and select Rename from the context menu. This is going to enable renaming for one of the files that you've selected. All the other files are still going to be selected. With the one file ready to be renamed, enter the name of the folder that's copied to your clipboard into the file name. Tap enter and you'll see that all the other files have also been given the same name and to prevent duplicates, a number has been added to the end of the file name. This is a built-in Windows 10 feature but if you want a utility that is a bit more sophisticated, I'd recommend using bulk rename utility. Download it, install it and then run the app. The first thing you should do is you should go to renaming options here on the toolbar and then select prevent duplicates. Next, use this navigation column on the left and navigate to the folder that you want to rename the files inside. After you select the folder, you're going to see all the files that are inside it in this pane on the right. Now we're going to make three changes to the rename criteria in this app. The first is in this name field. You want to open the name field and select remove from the options listed there. Second, you want to go to the append folder name field and open the drop down next to the name field and select prefix. The last thing you want to do is you want to go to the filter section and select the subfolders option. Once you've done that, make sure you've selected all the files that are inside the folder in this pane on the right and then click rename. You're going to see a bunch of confirmations on your screen. Go ahead and accept them. And after that, all your files are going to be renamed. So that's two quick ways to organize your desktop. I'll see you later with more tech tips.